Hey, you guys are liking the DOAs. Welcome back to the channel. So this morning I'm going out to do some fishing, but I don't have my kayak. I'm going to a spot that I used to catch a lot of really good trout. I'm really excited because it's got a lot of nice habitat. I've caught some nice trout and flounder there. And that's kind of what I'm going to target today. I would like to get some, get on some good flounder. Um, but the spot also holds really nice trout. Pulling up on the spot now. The great thing about this one spot is there's reefs that run from the beginning to the end of this thing, and we're gonna hit a good majority of them. So stay tuned and let's get on some good fish. Well, this was supposed to be blowing about five to eight, and this is definitely blowing a little harder than that, and the tide is a heck of a lot higher, but we're gonna make it work. Luckily, I've got all my stuff ready. All I gotta do is get get in my waders and then get in the water. So let's get ready. Tide is quite a bit higher than I was anticipating. But that's South Texas. What are you gonna do? There's some reefs that run all out along through here, and usually the tide is low enough for you to see them. But I don't know where they're at yet. I definitely don't remember. All right, he been riding the struggle bus all morning, but finally got into a decent trout here. He's hooked pretty deep. Had him in the net, but he jumped out. Look at that. That is a really nice trout. Actually a really, really nice trout. Completely swallowed that DOA. I'm gonna fish this area real thoroughly. Throwing it on a 1 16th ounce jig head. I was throwing a 1 8th and I was getting bites, but I was also getting snagged up a little bit more than I wanted to, so I dropped the weight. Oh, there's a bite. Feels like another trout. A little guy though. Oh, nope, it's a flounder. Look at that. Wow, look at this little guy. And I knew, I knew there was gonna, <laughs> I, I really believe that's the smallest flounder I've ever caught. I knew you guys were around here. That is one of the smallest flounders I've ever caught in my life. That is tiny. <laughs> that's so cool. There he goes. <laughs> that's cool. He may be keeper. I mean, they are completely annihilating that lure, man. Oh, that's a big one. That's a big one right there. Oh, yeah, that's a big one. That's a big trout. That is a big, big, big trout. Yes! Oh, that's a big one. <laughs> yes! That's a really nice trout. Look at that thing. Oh my goodness. And I mean, it's just all of them are swallowing it down. Look at the girth of that trout, man. That's like another 19, 20 inch fish right there. I mean, that is an absolute hog of a trout. Alrighty, so that's two really nice trout, smaller 17, all on the same bait. We're gonna continue to throw this same bait. <laughs> I mean, this DOA shrimp, or not shrimp, DOA paddle tail, which I didn't even know they had paddle tails. 
found these at, uh, I believe, Academy. Oh, there's another one. That's another really nice one. Look at that. <laughs> That's crazy. Two back to back. That's another keeper, I believe. Uh, maybe not. He might be too small. They are just absolutely crushing this DOA, man. It is nuts how far down in their mouth they're eating this thing. He's 16. Very next cast, 16 to another keeper. Not nearly as big. But I mean, we got four on the string. That is. That may be a red. Oh, no, that's a trout. That's a big in trout. I don't know what it is. It doesn't come up, that's for sure. Oh my. My God, it is a giant flipping trout. I mean, a giant trout. He's over there near my stringer. It is a giant trout, people. Look at that fish, people. Oh my goodness. I'm trying to remain calm, man, but that is a big end, the big end. Oh my God, look at the girth of this trout. Oh, and he's hooked on the outside of his mouth too. Had a sneaky suspicion that the Miradine, Miradine Heavy Dine Pro Series it's gonna get me a good fish. I've been getting bites on paddle tails like crazy. Kind of died off. So I was like, ah, let's tie on one of these Miradines. Look at this trout, people. Look at the size of that trout. That is crazy. My string or my tape only goes up to 22, and he's about an inch and a half past it. So we may be looking at a 23 inch trout here, peeps. Let's take a look at this stringer. Now that is a stringer full of trout. Goodness. That's a good day. That is a good flipping day. Alrighty, not a bad day at all. Got some really nice trout. Not bad for a little four hour wait session wanted to get out of the house do a little bit of fishing first time I fished actually here in Rockport and Little Bay and man, it didn't disappoint back in the day before the hurricane they used to come out here in the winter time and just slay trout red flounder everything out here all these reefs out here provide so much structure for bait fish shrimp everything to grab onto and it just brings all the all the fish around here wish we could have gotten onto some bigger bigger flounder but you know that's the way it goes so we'll take with the good with the bad killer stringer let's take a look at this stringer one more time that's a good day if i've ever seen one man five really nice trout some smaller ones in there some really nice 19s 20s in there so that's going to be the end of this video check back for jordan's fish tails for some more content and keep it locked in here man hit that subscribe button let me know what you'd like to see and i'll catch you guys next time